welcome to 2010 Copeland Trophy Red Carpet Special. My name is Paul Lucuria and I'll be your host for this special, a two-time Copeland Trophy winner. Probably should have been three, but I got rubbed on one occasion by, uh, by Bucks. Let's take a look and see who the favourites are. Uh, Dane Swan, mm -hmm. um, Scott, Penderbury. Penderbury, and hopefully this one here. Daisy. Thanks, Dale. I'll go with uh, Dane Swan and followed by Scott Pendlebury and Harry O'Brien. Three. Uh, I'll give him his top five in order. Okay. How's that? Swan. Swan. Pendlebury. Thomas. Mm -hmm. Didac. O'Brien. Uh, Maxwell will be around 20 odd. Uh, Swanee. Swanee will win. Uh, Daisy second. Harry third. The net. Quick question, any truth in the rumour that Mick was going to get a, a magpie tattoo on his left buttocks? <laughs> Didac going for the George Clooney look today. Um, no tie, the growth. What's happened, mate? You're running a bit late today? No, nah, no, I was running on time. Um, it's just I looked in the wardrobe and I had about 35 black and white ties, but not the right one. Simon, a little bit, uh, will you be emotional tonight? Um, no, hopefully not. Should be right, Paul. Should be right. Not like me. Mate, before you go, can you give us the top three for the night? Yeah, I can, but I know them, so I won't. <laughs> so you won't? <laughs> um, uh, Dale Thomas, I think, will win. And I'll yeah. D-Swan, D-Swan, D-Swan. Yeah, D-Swan, uh, S. Pendlebury and Dale Thomas. Yeah, Swan, uh, Pendlebury and Didac. Number one, Paul Curia. Mm -hmm. Two, Nathan Buckley. Three, Jimmy Clement. The uh, oh, Swanee Pendles and uh, maybe Didac. Um, Pendles will be there, um, Dids, um, Tomo. The old man? Yeah. The old man. The Swanee's a hot favourite for the night. Um, are you a little bit nervous about your record being broken? We can't get him in tonight. Well, not tonight. This is a night of class. Anything to do with a Collingwood Premiership is class. I'll finish up in 10 minutes. Would you, would you like to catch up for a red? No, I'm busy, sorry.